What's up folks, Ike here. It's time for another product unboxing. What I have here is the Alto Stealth Pro wireless transmitter and receiver system. What this system is designed for, for you to run speakers wirelessly. Like if you have a speaker that you need to put in a location that's really far away, the transmission range is 200 feet. So if you have a, a, a speaker that you need to put away from your system, maybe like in the back of the room or something like that, and you don't want to run wires, you can just hook up this system to your speaker with the transmitter and you could have your signal go through it wirelessly. This is actually the second generation of the Stealth. This is the Stealth Pro. It's a two channel stereo system and let's see what's in the box. The main difference between this one and the one before, this is UHF, it's frequency agile, you can set your channels and there's a display on both the receiver and the transmitters. A display on there that gives you information on what channel you're on and uh, how strong your signal is and a whole bunch of other cool things. They stepped it up a notch, made it a more professional unit, hence the name. It's called the Stealth Pro. Not the Stealth Amateur like the last one, this is the Pro. Let's see what's in the box. We have the usual suspects. We have a manual. We have the cables necessary to hook up the receivers, antennas for the transmitter, two power supplies, power supply for the transmitter. Are they all the same? They look all the same, that's weird. Half rack, rack mount, I don't know exactly what this is yet. Some square thing, I'm sure it's gonna come useful. You got the antennas. Two. Antennas all look kind of identical, so it's, that's like actually a cool thing. And here is the receiver. Receiver one, receiver two, the transmitter. So you got the transmitter with a balanced output, 12 volt power supply. It has a stereo mono switch, so you could flip it to mono, which is nice, in case you're just uh, running a, a remote speaker out somewhere, you want a mono signal, that's pretty cool. Velcro, all right, cool. And a couple screws for something I don't know yet, but it looks like this screw is a standard flying size screw that you could actually put the transmitter right on top of the speaker. That's a nice little touch. I'm gonna hook it up along with the Mackie DL32S and see how it works. But it's gotta turn it on. This right here is the receiver. It's diversity, it has two it's antennas, it's diversity. Yeah, so you got all your information on here. It tells you what, what frequency you're on. Right now it's 540.050. This is right here is the transmitter. What you would do is you would plug the transmitter into an output on your mixer. You could get an XLR output or a quarter inch because you have a XLR and quarter inch combination jack in the back. One, two, all right, there you go. I flipped it into mono, so now we get a mono signal. But you could do a stereo signal because it has two channels. I don't hear any noise. It sounds pretty clean. We have a speaker hooked up wirelessly using the Alto Professional Stealth Pro system. This one right here. And uh, it seems to be working. We can't really test the range because we're in the house right now. So, But the, on the box it says 200 feet, which would cover pretty much most big ballrooms. If you want to put a speaker in the back of a ballroom, 200 feet is pretty big. You figure a football field is 300 feet. So you're talking two-thirds the length of a football field is how far the range is for this transmitter and receiver combination right here. So yeah, it looks like it works right out of the box, which is also a good thing, you know. It's connected to the speaker with a, a wire that's a mini XLR to XLR wire. It's kind of a specific wire. I don't understand why they didn't just make an XLR, like a regular XLR to XLR, I guess, to keep the weight down maybe. But it takes a mini XLR to XLR to the speaker. And there's a, from the mixer to the actual transmitter, you need a regular XLR, XLR cable or you could use a quarter inch cable. So that's it. That's the unboxing of the Alto system. And I did get this system from kpodj.com. KPODJ, better prices without the hassle. KPODJ.com. Thank you for watching and I'll smell you later. It sounds clean. It sounds crisp. I don't hear any noise and it's being transmitted wirelessly. Speakers being hooked up wirelessly. I wouldn't hook up any main speakers wirelessly like this. Why would you chance it? You know, you get interference, it's possible. But for a fill speaker, 
if you want to put some speakers in the back of the room or some place where the sound needs to carry, you could just hook it up remotely and not have to run any wires. That's the beauty of this system.